To calibrate the sensor, we need to start the ventilation for the calibration is done at 21% uh, of oxygen. Start the ventilation. We got a message, calibrate O2 sensor. I will press the button for O2. Go to calibration and calibration starts. It will count down 90 seconds and after 90 seconds the calibration is done. Now the calibration is done. We can go to O2 again. Switch on the oxygen supply. And now we will see that the oxygen concentration will rise, will increase. While in this setting we will reach a quite high, up to 100%, 99.9% FiO2, um, because the oxygen concentration is highly depending on I2E ratio, frequency, pressure levels, so there's a certain amount of oxygen fed in into the device and the higher the volume, the lower the FiO2 concentration. So we will see now the FiO2 at a very low pressure level and after that I will increase the IPAP to see to a normal level or to a much higher level to 25 hectopascal uh, and we will see the resulting FiO2. So it's 99% almost, still increasing, but I will switch to or increase uh, the IPAP now to 25. Much higher pressure and the FiO2 will uh, drop to about 70%. The oxygen sensor calibration needs to be done every time the device is put on a, on a patient, on a new patient, or every 24 hours. Hours.